Welcome back to Deconstructing with Dawn. I came home today to all these lovely boxes and wanted to share everything with you. Um, I've opened up everything so I wouldn't have to struggle with that, but I have not looked inside. So, actually, before I do that, let's start with this. I went to the 99 cent store today. Normally, I don't do 99 cent hauls, but this was kind of cool. Um, I thought it was a knockoff of something, but it's actually um, Taylor Swift lotion, um, Taylor by Taylor Swift scented body lotion, and it's really nice. It um, was 99 cents from the 99 cent store. It has a really good, you know, perfumey, perfumey um, smell and absorbs nicely. So um, I got that for 99 cents. Thought that was pretty good. Um, I got this Milani um, gel powder eyeshadow. Um, I've never used any Milani products, but I've seen a lot of reviews on it, so I thought for 99 cents I could try out this eyeshadow. It's kind of like a grayish, bluish slate color. Um, and I got these. All my makeup is in acrylic organizers, and I was just thinking today that I needed to go to like get some more for um, lipsticks. And at the 99 cents store, there was just these two. They were sitting on the shelf all by themselves. Um, and they feel thick and heavy, so they're pretty good. So um, they are nine holes each, so 18 lipsticks, and God knows I got more than that to put in there. So anyhow, that was that real quick. Um, Sephora, um, I don't, um, briefly, I canceled my um, Sephora Play subscription because I think like out of the four, five months that I got it, um, I only got like one or two things that I actually enjoyed, so um, I canceled it. I also canceled Birch Box. However, I had already signed up for the um, $10 a year, um, what, unlimited, you know, two-day express shipping kind of thing. So um, I had seen from somebody else's page that you basically just order the most inexpensive thing and get the samples and you get them for free. So um, we have a Sephora at JCPenney's, but they're really stingy when it comes to samples. So I thought I would just order the most least expensive thing I could find, which happened to be a dollar eight, and I got three free samples. I'll probably never use the thing that I got for a dollar because I don't even know what it is actually. Um, there you go. <laughs> um, okay, oh, uh, Makeup Forever palette. And I think it's just an empty palette. Like a, maybe an eyeshadow holder? Yes. <laughs> well, maybe that Melania thing could fit Melania. Oh, well, whatever. Actually, Actually, I can use this. Um, it's magnetic, two holes, and I have um, Urban Decay, like a little sample thing in lounge, and I could stick that in there and use it. So yeah, I can use this for a dollar. That's what I got. So then um, I selected three free samples, and I'm really digging the Too Faced um, All Over uh, Primer, Hang Hangover or Hangover Primer. Anyway, this is a Too Faced Glitter Glue Glitter Shadow Primer. And I had gotten some Glitter Shadow from Ipsy last month and it wouldn't stick and I didn't know you had to have primer for it. So I want to give that a shot, put those two together. Um, got Tom Ford Orchid Soleil, so Sun Orchid by Tom Ford. I've never sent, tried any of Tom Ford stuff, so um, let's... Ooh, it's um, really, it's interesting. Almost a note of grandmother there, but, but really bright to begin with. So, whatever. I love perfume samples. I know a lot of people don't, but I do. Um, Lancome Paris, um, a tint. Oh, crap. I've gotten this in my 10 day makeup challenge thing. I did not like this at all. So, oh well, whatever. I'll, it'll take all three just like cover my nose or something, but whatever. So that was a bummer, but again, a dollar eight. And I will actually use this. So maybe I'll spend another dollar and get three other different samples. <laughs> Anyhow, okay, so now on to the real boxings. Um, this is the Walmart Beauty Box, which is quarterly. It's a subscription, so every three months it's $5, and it is this is the winter box. They have two versions. They have the classic and the trendsetter. The classic is for ladies or anybody over 35. The trendsetter is for under 35. I didn't know the age thing until after I'd already signed up, so I get both. So I spend $10 a quarter, and I get the classic and the trendsetter. Um, it doesn't seem like there's much of a difference from the videos that I've seen this month in the two, but 
we'll see. And I don't know which is which, so I'm just going to get into it and go from there. Um, so the box is really cute, actually. It has like the snowflakes, and so the boxes are always really good and, and salvageable. Um, the inside says, treat yourself this season with beauty. Has really cute uh, paper insert. Um, treat yourself. Share the love. Oh, you can. Oh, it says gift a beauty box subscription to someone special by visiting um, beautybox.com or beautyboxwalmart.com. Anyhow, so this is what is inside here. It looks pretty good. I don't know. Again, I don't know which one is which. Um, okay, so Tresemme Volumizing Dry Shampoo. I don't use dry shampoos because um, I don't. My fluff ball of a hair doesn't doesn't like any dry shampoo. So, but that's Tresemme. It's a good sample. One point one five ounce. Oh, this I'll use. Um, ex exotically creamy coconut body rich butter. You know what? I don't remember seeing this kind of stuff in other people's stuff. Either one of these, I don't think. So I don't know. And plus, I'm late to the party. I don't know why I got my box so much later than everybody else, but it came today. Anyway, um, this is a body butter, coconut body butter. Ooh, it's really thick too. And it's a pretty good sample. So um, it is 1.7 fluid ounce. So that's pretty good. Ooh, it's really thick. And smells like coconut, <laughs> as expected. Um, here is a Dove Deep Moisture Body Wash, and um, Cure, Curel, I think all the boxes got this, Curel um, Wet Skin Moisturizer. Again, you know, you, you, um, it, it's activated when you get out of the shower or in the shower um, after you're, before you jet towel off, you apply this. And there's a $4 off coupon, that's really good. And then we have foil packets of L'Oreal Smooth Intense Ultimate Straight. Oh, that's fantastic because I need my hair. No, three, three packet. I, I actually use these. Um, they, I get about two uses out of them. Um, and then just inserts about that um, in spa Nirvana Spa, the, the coconut lotion. And then coupons for some magazines, In Style People and Style Watch. Dollar off each one. So that is one box. I would guess that that's probably the classic. I think, because I believe the trendsetter comes with a mascara. So let's see the other one. So this is the other box, exactly the same. It's just the contents are different. Exactly the same inside. And feels the same. Yep, this is, looks like, ooh, looks like the trendsetter might have got more though. Um, this is what's inside. And yeah, so. Um, right off the top is the CoverGirl um, Lash Fast Volume uh, Mascara. So this alone is like $7.99, so this pays for the box hands down. Well, that's strange though. In here, maybe this is classic because here's some Pond's Anti-Wrinkle Cream, unless they're trying to make the trendsetters not get wrinkles like the classic ladies. I don't know. I don't know which is which now. Um, anyhow, so here's a Pond's um, Anti-Wrinkle Cream, 1.75 ounce. Um, I can't, oh, well it has a seal on it anyway, but whatever, Anti-Wrinkle Cream. Um, my face is really sensitive, so I'll put it on if I have any reaction at all. I just put it on my feet. My feet aren't sensitive. <laughs> Again, okay, Avino Age Absolutely Ageless Daily Moisturizer with some SPF in it, um, 0.5 fluid ounce. So maybe this is, wait a second, there's two of them. Daily Moisturizer and Restorative Night Cream. Huh, whatever, Avino's nice. And then the same exact of um, Deep Moisture Body Wash. And then the same exact um, Curel Wet lotion. Um, I will be honest, I didn't like the, um, what was it, Jergens? I didn't like it at all. It was like really greasy. Okay, this has got to be the classic box because here's some root uh, concealer, $1.50 off some uh, root concealer. Hello, I need that. Um, yes, yeah, so this has got to be. And then um, this is just a pan talking about Neutrogena towelettes to wipe your makeup off. So those are the two boxes, and they were different. I thought they were the same, but 
they were different except for what two products so um anyhow that's nice those are the walmart five dollar beauty boxes that are subscription um they just take it out of your account they let you know ahead of time when they're going to do it and um you get five dollars for each one taken out of your account um, beauty box from Target. They had two versions. They had a five dollar one and a seven dollar one. I wanted to be completely directive of comparative to the Target versus the Walmart, so I went with just the five dollar one. Plus, I didn't like the stuff that was in the seven dollar one. Targets, however, they sell out like the same day they launch. They're not a subscription. They're usually sold the first Monday of every month. And I believe this Monday, this month, it might have been like the second of January. And um, you, I, I follow my subscription addiction, and at like midnight West Coast, she lets everybody know they're live. I'm still awake because I have insomnia, so I buy it like you know midnight, 2 a.m. somewhere around there, um, the first Monday of every month. Um, usually they're five, seven, or ten dollars. There's um, sometimes multiple options. This month there were. Um, last month I think there was a men's option and a women's option, and they were ten dollars. Ten dollars for women, I think seven dollars for men. But this month there was just two women's boxes. Um, it's my dog, not my stuff over. And um, I went again with the five dollar box because I want to be exactly comparative to Walmart to see which was better. Although I'm always going to get Walmart and I'll always get Target because I like the Target ones. Um, anyhow, this is the Target box. Inside it is wrapped. It says Beauty Goals, wrapped in blue tissue paper. Um, right off the bat, this was $5, and you get a $3 off coupon um, for your next purchase of $15 or more in cosmetics, skincare, and hair care. Just a little brief thing. I spent, I got $30 in e.l.f. products last month. You, with this coupon and the Christmas clearance, um, I ended up paying $7.50 for $30 in e.l.f. stuff. It was everything you needed, like um, face, contouring, blush, eyes, lip, mascara, the whole thing. Thing was supposed to be thirty dollars. I paid seven fifty because it was clearance and I had this coupon, so that was fantastic. Anyhow, this is what is inside. Um, oops, upside down here. So this is what is inside, and that I mean, Jesus, this is a full size toothpaste and this coup coupon. That's five dollars right there. Um, this is Colgate Enamel Health Whitening. Um, now we have some Palmer's Coconut Oil Body Lotion. So coconut is the theme this month. Oh, it's really thick. Um, I'm sure it's, my hand still smells like coconut from the last one. But that is not going to be friendly to stay on. Um, yep. Um, it's not as thick as that body butter, which body butter is thicker anyway, but my hands are so dry. I have a, a thyroid, I had, I have two thyroid conditions. I go, I have Graves disease and it makes me, I have, Graves disease causes hyperthyroidism, but I'm clinically hypo, um, I get the, the fatness, the fluffiness, <laughs> my hair is a disaster, my hands crack, um, I don't know, I get a lot of symptoms from hypo um, because I had radiation from a tumor from the thyroid. Anyhow, so um, I need lotion like crazy. And well, here's another one. <laughs> um, this is Vaseline Intensive Care Cocoa Radiant. Heals dry skin and to receive its natural glow. So um, I'm probably not going to be able to smell this because I have so much on my hand. But it's, yeah, it's really thick. I hands just smell like coconut and Taylor Swift. So, I don't know. It's fine. <laughs> Absorbs nicely. That's nice. Well, uh, that's the last thing I need in my life. Quick curls. Don't need that. But whatever. Best darn curl cream, period. Wavy, curly, and tight, curly textures. Miss Jessie's. Uh, I'm not going to use this. But whatever. It's nice. Um, mane and tail and body. Um, shampoo, which I've seen, I've seen gigantic. I used to think this was just for horses because it has horses on it. And my mom would buy it. I'm like, why are you putting horse soap on you? <laughs> anyway, it's not. It's for humans. Mane, tail, mane and tail and body um, for shiny, manageable hair shampoo. So maybe this is like a conditioner because often they'll do a shampoo and a conditioner. I don't know. Whatever. I'm not going to use that though. Um, oh no, this is nice. Oh wow. 
Um, Carol's Daughter Black Vanilla Leave-In Conditioner. This is actually another reason I chose. I love black, um, like a black currant and a vanilla combo together. Oh my god, I just sprayed the wall. Let me spray. This is a, oh, it smells so good. This is a leave-in conditioner that I just sprayed on <laughs> my kitchen wall and my arm, but whatever. I've got so much lotion, I need to wipe it all off anyway. Okay, this is nice. Um, a simple cleansing facial wipes. Always need those. It's by Simple, like I just said. Um, here is Shea Moisture. Oh, okay, this has nothing to do with it. Well, it does have something to do with this. I had a Shea Moisture BB cream. Most awful stuff in the world, but I've liked other um, Shea Moisture stuff. This is a um, shampoo and conditioner. Um, Peace Rose Oil Complex Nourish and Silken Shampoo and Conditioner with Date Palm and Camellia Extract. So again, I like these little packets. Um, I do, that's nice. This is the shampoo, this is the conditioner. Normally they chinch you on the conditioner, but this is um, bigger than the shampoo. Anyhow, so those are my three boxes and my little things from the Scent Store and Sephora. Um, thank you so much for watching, like and subscribe and all that. I'm going to be doing um, a video, um, I got some 9 cent makeup stuff, I'm going to do, do a video, um, you know, a 9 cent face and um, I'm going to be doing a giveaway, my first ever giveaway. Um, I'm thinking of Urban Decay products because that's like one of my most favorite new kind of stuff that I'm using, but just like a couple of items because I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Anyhow, so I'm going to have a giveaway. I'm thinking once I hit 300 subscribers because I'm close to two, so once I get to 300, I'm going to have a giveaway, and I'm going to be doing a Niantic face uh, thing. Anyway, thank you for watching, and like and subscribe.